The overall goal of this procedure is to measure the changes in the mechanical properties of underlying model bacterial cell targets caused by drug-target binding interactions and to quantify antibacterial resistance. This is accomplished by first depositing 20 nanometers of gold film onto one side of the pre-cleaned cantilever sensor array. The second step is to self-assemble appropriate surface targets mimicking drug-susceptible and drug-resistant bacterial phenotypes onto six of the cantilever sensors, while the remaining two cantilever sensors are assembled with irrelevant bacterial model targets to act as measurement controls. Next, the cantilever sensor arrays are loaded into a liquid flow chamber. The final step is to prepare drug solutions at clinically relevant concentration ranges and sequentially inject each drug concentration over the cantilever sensor arrays. Ultimately, laser light focused onto the free ends of the cantilever sensor array is used to show cantilever deflections caused by the changes in surface stress that arise from drug-target binding interactions. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods like surface plasmon resonance and quartz crystal microbalance is that it detects the surface strain generated by drug target binding interactions, directly measuring specific nanomechanical forces caused by each drug binding to the surface targets. This method can help answer key questions in the pharmacology field, such as the speed, efficiency, and accuracy of dosing. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle because